Hey everybody, welcome to a random Animal Crossing video. Yeah, I just wanted to make a very chill vi video because the Animal Crossing Direct comes out tomorrow. And, uh, well, you guys probably have already seen it because it's already out by the time you're seeing this video. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna pick up some shells because I can. But yeah, I really just wanted to make a very laid-back video and Animal Crossing is the most laid-back thing ever. So I was like... What other thing could I do? Uh, what is that? Do I have this? I don't think I do. A cricket. Do I have a cricket? I don't know. I don't think I have a cricket. I, I have a cricket. Uh, but is it already in the museum? Because I know there's a bug I have that isn't already in the museum. Well, there's a mole cricket is here. Where about, what about the cricket? Huh? Huh? Where is it? Is it over here? There it is. Yeah, I already have it in the museum. Okay, fine. I caught that for no reason. Anyway, I guess I can make a few predictions for the Animal Crossing Direct. Maybe you're not seeing this before it comes out. I, I don't freaking know. Those things only give like 200 bells. I ain't gonna catch that. Um, let me think. We're obviously gonna get Brewster. Like, that's, that's the most obvious thing. We're obviously gonna get the Roost. That was basically just revealed to all of us. I guess instead of predictions, this is more of a, Hey, I want this in Animal Crossing video. I know I said I wasn't going to make a video like that in my, uh, in my Nintendo Direct video I did a couple weeks back. But now, I'm like, hey, I want to talk about this, so I'm going to. I'm going to talk about it anyway. I don't even have notes or anything. I'm just going to say things that come straight to my mind. Oh my god, I have Kolovar. Arr, I don't care if it's me to turn it I'm just gonna talk. Um, so, I kind of want, uh, Tortimer's Island back, because there's nothing to do in multiplayer in this game, and I kind of enjoy playing this game with people sometimes. So, the fact that there's really nothing to do on your island with people is just disappointing, and honestly, I wish there was more to do. So Tortimer's Island would be great. It's, you know, mini games. Mini games. That's basically what Tortimer's Island was in the in Animal Crossing New Leaf. I want that to be a thing. I I want that to come back. Also, just having Tortimer ba Tortimer back in Animal Crossing would be great. Like I know he retired and everything, but I don't care. He's still a living thing. Let me see him, unless he's already dead. Uh, oh yeah, I have the dive for your stupid crap. As you can see, I have Luigi's mustache on and the top hat and a freaking business suit, which I really like. So, got the top hat from Shep. Earlier I got a freaking... A what is it? A, f a fedora from Antonio. I don't know what it is with him always giving me a freaking fedora, but whatever. Communicator part, please. Uh, no, just the entire freaking phone. Okay, I forgot. We just grab the phone and then come back. Whatever. Um, let me think. I obviously want more Nintendo items. Like, if they brought back the fortune cookie or something, that would be cool. But, um... Yeah, I just want more Nintendo-based items. Like, the Zelda items, that obviously needs to happen this year. Or Metroid items, that also is one thing that needs to happen this year. Metroid and Zelda both had anniversaries this year, and also Donkey Kong. So, come on, give me some freaking items. I... And speaking of giving me items, I'm about to get an item from Golivar. He's gonna send me a late letter later. You... Dang it. Okay, those guys give money. <laughs> Good money, too. Okay. Give me this shell. I'm trying to think of more things I want. It's not really too much, but... Um... Personality. Yes, please. Give personality for the animals, because... Every animal in this game just gives... Repeated dialogue all the time. It's every single freaking time I play this game. I get repeated dialogue over and over again. You know what? It's called Animal Crossing. I want to freaking interact with the animals in this game. Why can't we do that? I don't know. I mean, you can interact with them, but not very well. They're all very boring. And 
I don't know. I, I don't really like any of the animals in this game. They have, like, no personality whatsoever. I wish they would have personality! That would be great! But they don't. I get repeated dialogue all the time. And also, you know what I wish was back in Animal Crossing? I know people may have not liked this from Animal Crossing New Leaf or something. That's probably why they removed it. Um, the fact that they make you... They come up to you and like, Hey, can you deliver this gift to somebody? I wish I could do that. I wish I could do that in this game. They barely ever do that. I highly doubt that mechanic is actually in this game. And if it is, I've never come across it. So... Yeah, come on, give me more animal interaction. I want to actually do things with the animals. I want them to be able to visit my house. You can't do that in this game. It's terrible. Okay. I already know signpost. Really? Hold on, what? I already know signpost. Are you kidding me? Is it the house where... I was wondering if I already knew signposts, or maybe this is a completely different item that I know nothing about. Uh, actually, it's a sign. Why? Okay, yeah, uh, okay. Yeah. I already know these. That's unfortunate. There's supposed to be, like, a sign where you can put designs on it. I want that. Because right now, uh, there's this area where red shows up in my island, and it's at the back of the island, and I just have a little canvas sitting there with his face on it. Because, up, oh, Rosie, what, what's wrong? Mary, Mary, you're a completely different cat. <laughs> hey, perfect timing. I was just thinking of my fab new nickname for you, Champ. Champ is nice and all, but I think I've got something that's more... What is, is that word? Okay, what is it? What do you think about... Hey, <laughs> all I can think of is Sweetkins. Pretty cool, right? You're... You're punishing me for leaving for five months, aren't you? <sighs> Fine, you can go with Sweetkins. Fabulous Sweetkins it is! See you around, Sweetkins. Oh god, no. Oh! I got a thing. I got Nook Miles. I got- I talked to animals. Yay, woohoo. I talked to my neighbors. Woohoo. I have 33,000 Nook Miles. Maybe I should go spend those. Oh yeah, I got new music. Got new KK music. I'm gonna freaking play that because I've never heard it. I've never heard it before and I want to listen to it. This video is freaking weird. It's like a hybrid of a Let's Play video and a freaking discussion video. It's weird. Uh, I have to... How do you do this? I haven't played this game in months, so this is bad. Uh, here you are. I wish you could get the Dr. Shrunk shuffle in this game. That would be great. But, um... <laughs> Maybe that's already in this game, actually. It might be. I don't know. If it is, I would want it because that thing is hilarious. You know the little dance he does in New Leaf? It's it's perfect. I, I wish it was in this game. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Another th kind of thing that's probably a bit of a stretch that I'd like to have. The ability to change the music in this game. I hate the music in this game. The best track from this game is... Uh, the 1 p.m. music, or maybe 2 p.m. Um, I don't know which one it is. I think it's 1 p.m. But, yeah, that's the best track in the game. And every other track is just, well, um, take a listen. I mean, it's not bad, it's just boring. Also, here's the red canvas I was telling you about. Yeah... The only real tour I've given of my island was on an unlisted video that you can only, like, get to on my Twitter. So, uh, I might as well just show you everything my island has to offer now. I'm pretty sure this is Goldie's house. Yeah. I want to see Goldie! She's adorable and I love her. She's, like, my favorite animal. I love Goldie. Um... 
Well, man, do I feel like a third wheel. Did you get this from Antonio? Um... You just have the judge's bell here. Okay, hello. Look who's here! How have you been? I feel like it, there was something... Uh, oh, yeah, I haven't been here for months. Need something, Wolf? I just want to chat! Having such good friends stop by to make... I can't read. I don't know why I decided to play Animal Crossing when I can't read. Hello, Antonio. Wow, I got really lucky. I got... I really got lucky visiting Goldie, because now you're here, too. Honk! You're up for a little three-on-three -three basketball between you, me, and Goldie? We got a team! We should start practicing, alright? Who's got a ball, honk? I don't like sports, so I'm not gonna join in. <laughs> I got a lot more knitting done while I'm listening to my favorite music on my cute music player. It's just stitch after stitch, knitting along with the beat. Sometimes it's nice to get lost in the rhythm. I didn't want to click on that, I wanted to click on this. I wonder what's inside. I'll just take a teeny tiny peek. I see. Yes, it makes sense. Those are all clothing I gave her! <laughs> Bye, Goldie! You're the best animal in this island. I probably shouldn't say that. I like Shep, too. Um, who are you? Bill. Yeah, Bill. Okay. I love Bill! I love Bill. I had both Goldie and Bill on my New Leaf Town. I love Bill. Bill is just the cutest duck in the world. I had two ducks in my Animal Crossing Town in New Leaf. I had this this adorable boy here, Bill, and Dina. So those are the two ducks I had on my Animal Crossing New Leaf Town. Uh, hello, Bill. Welcome to the world-famous Bill Workout Center. I want to chat. There's something different about you today. Is it the towel pat? You've been doing more lunges or what? Me? Why is that his... Did somebody play my game? <laughs> well, no matter how ripped you get or, or how you disguise yourself, I'll always know it's you. Um, I highly doubt I'll be getting ripped anytime soon. Okay, well, I gave him these pilot sunglasses and that hat because, I don't know, I just thought they'd look good on him. And he never wore them. How dare you. I'm leaving. And here we have Shep's house. So Shep's, like, down here somewhere. Hello, Shep, where are you? Where art thou, Shep? I did play a little bit of this game earlier. Like, I dug up fossils. Oh yeah, I completed the entire fossil exhibit a long time ago in this game. It's been a whole freaking year since this game came out. It's been actually way more than a year since this game came out, but um, I still haven't finished bugs or fish, and it's gonna take me literal years to complete art. Also, this is where the roost is going to go! I can't wait! Hello, Brewster. I don't want to talk to you because I don't have anything for you because I've already caught everything for this month, I think. But down here, I have completed the fossil exhibit. I have every single fossil in this game. I I, I, I like it. So I'm just going to take a, just a short little stroll through it, and you can listen to the museum music while I do so. And yeah, that's all the fossils in this game. There's nothing up there, by the way. It's just a bunch of random images of characters for some reason. Like, this is Apollo, I think. Uh, this is 
Kit and Ellie and Antonio and Rover. <laughs> that was a weird voice crack. Goldie or maybe a, just a dog. Uh, I have a bear named Chelsea, I think. This might be her. Where's the map? It's literally right here. Charsley, okay. I never talked to Rex or Charsley, so um, we don't talk about them. Epona, which isn't in this game. Uh, Rocco was here. Uh, Ganon the pig. I don't know what you are. I don't. That you're a cow. You're a deer. You're a a bunny. I think. And you're a mouse. And you're sh you're, you're Shari. I I okay. Bye, Shari. I'm gonna leave the museum now because I don't really have all the bugs or all the fish or all the art yet, unfortunately. I haven't been getting red at all. Also, I haven't played this game in months, so I guess it doesn't really matter. All this talk of the Nintendo Direct has really got me wanting to play the game, so here we are. I guess. I don't even know how long I've been recording for, it's just like 17 minutes. Well, short little anime crossing video, it's not short at all, someone help me. Just a little bit of an island tour before I before I watch this Nintendo Direct later tomorrow because it's the 14th. It, uh, yeah, it's the 14th. Tomorrow's the 15th, which is when the Animal Crossing Direct is. I can't freaking wait for that. I am going to be very happy when that comes out. Um, yeah, I can't. Just. <sighs> Want to see my house? I'm going to show you my house. You're going to see my house now. I don't care if you don't want to see it. You're going to see it anyway. Hello, house. I played this game for like a couple days, but I... Okay, maybe this isn't my return of five months, but I have played this yesterday to get some footage for that uh, Animal Crossing Direct video, and today... I don't know if I'm going to use that Animal Crossing Direct video footage. You never know. I still don't know how I'm going to structure that video. It will be out on Saturday, hopefully. Um, hello, Halloween room. Yeah, this is my Halloween room. And because it is another month of Halloween, I have two Jack portraits. I have two of them. One over on this side and another one over there. And in the third year, I'm going to get a third one and I'm going to put it over here. I really like the Halloween furniture set in this game. It's really cool. I don't have the pumpkin, the what's it called, carriage in here because it's it's by the pumpkin patch. I have a pumpkin patch and so is the scarecrow. I have a scarecrow over there too, I think. Maybe. Maybe I've removed it. Uh, got the one year anniversary cake because I played this game when it came out. I got this on the 21st, which is the day after Animal Crossing New Horizons came out, but I pre-ordered the game, so I got pretty much everything that was cool. And I got my Nintendo Switch Lite just sitting here. Uh, Nintendo Switch. Love it. I think they I, I think they might just throw the OLED model in here in the update. Like that would just make sense. They have the OLED now. Like that's been out for I think a week now. Maybe it hasn't been out that long. That was a weird thing. Been out. I didn't get to do Rover's thing this year, unfortunately. So I only have the Rover suitcase. But maybe you got that again. I I don't know what the items were. Here are my Happy Home Academy Awards. You got this for some reason. I don't know why this is here. I don't know why they gave you that. But I wish they gave me a longer table. Because I'd want to fit the gold, silver, and bronze trophies on here. But no, I can only fit two. They gave me the table. So they were obviously intending for you to put something on the table. And, uh... Yeah, I also got the Happy Home Academy banner back there. I like this room. It's very cozy. I It's just super cool because it's like the dark oak and everything. I really like this room. I'm not sure about the carpet here, though. I might change that. And also the bed. The bed needs to change. Like, it needs to be a darker oak wood. But other than that, I really like this room. And maybe the pot here should be a darker color. But other than that, I really like how this room looks. This might be one of my favorite rooms in the house. So yeah, there's that. That's my bedroom. Um, and of course, you've already seen the main area here. 
this is where I do things. Got my Animal Crossing Nintendo Switch. I really wish I had that in real life, but I don't. I also have Jingle's uh, picture there. And in here is the Harvest Festival uh, stuff. Yeah, it's literally just a Thanksgiving furniture set. I really like this furniture set. It's it's cozy. It's just very cozy. It also is kind of old timey, like with the with the wall and everything. I I kind of like it. I I really like this room, and the carpet in the middle is just really cool. I like the carpet. I think it's a part of the floor though. I I don't think that's a carpet. I think it's just a part of the floor. Maybe, I don't know. It's been a while since I played this game. Anyway, down here, the honestly most disappointing set, in my opinion, the Mario furniture set. Yeah, I have all these. I am, I did not do good with this room. I didn't even buy another pipe. It doesn't even go anywhere, this. It doesn't even go anywhere. I'm thinking of maybe... You know what? Hold on. I just had a thought. I don't even have to leave to do this, actually, because I've already bought every... Like, I think I need to buy, like, a hundred items to unlock the... The uh, Nook Shopping app. But I have the Nook Shopping app, so I can just go here and buy a pipe. And then I can put it on Red's Beach, where he arrives. So I could just go in here... Hop in the pipe, and then I'd be at Red's place. <laughs> That'd be awesome. That'd be cool. And also, that's near the shopping district I have, too, so. This is the ether. The ether? I've been playing too much Xenoblade. Um, <laughs> this is the Easter furniture set. I really like the Easter furniture set. It's really cool. Kind of, not really. It's not cool, but I like It's pretty. It's It looks cool. And, uh, I need to make more of those things. I need to make more of those. You see the things above the bed? Yeah, I need to make more of those. I only made one and was like, I'll do good in the room, and then didn't put it anywhere else. Yep. This room looks great. I didn't get a chance to collect all the uh, new Easter furniture for uh, this year, because I just wasn't playing the game at the time, because I lost interest in the game, to be quite honest with you. I just quit the game for months. I was like, I'm gonna keep at it. I'm gonna play this game for a whole year. I'm gonna love this game. And then I ended up not really caring about it because it has less content than New Leaf. Which is sad. It's a sequel. It's uh, supposed to evolve the series, not devolve it by getting rid of content. I don't understand why they did that. I would be cool with them doing updates if they didn't take away content to do the updates. No matter how I try, I can't... Do you have a balloon hat? I... I'll take it! I'll take the balloon hat! Thank you! I've been wanting a balloon hat for so long! Balloon hat, balloon hat, balloon hat. Never mind, I don't want a balloon hat anymore. Okay. I thought it was the balloon hat from New Leaf, and it's not. It's just lame. But I haven't got any balloon items from balloons. This is weird. Th this is strange. I'm gonna wear this for the rest of the video. <laughs> it's perfect. It's perfect for me. Also, this video is gonna end very soon because it's like... I've been playing for like almost half an hour now. I need bugs. Are those orange stink bugs anywhere? I need to catch those. Speaking of stink bugs, I live in a place just full of stink bugs. They're everywhere. <laughs> They're everywhere around where I live. Just, just all over the place. Every single day I have to deal with one or two of them. And I never leave the house, so that's, <laughs> that's saying something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I should probably tell you the backstory of this grave. So... Once upon a time, I had stitches in my town. And, well, you know. He kind of figured out my secrets, so I had to, well... Well, you can see what I did to him. Yeah, he's just... I couldn't let anyone else find out! I could not let anyone find out about my secrets, 
So here he is. And of course I put, put some flowers on his grave because I care about him. I love Stitches, he's great. And because he's literally just a stuffed bear, I can bring him back to life anytime I want. So yeah, it's great. Anyway, here's Red's beach. I'm definitely gonna put a warp pipe like in the middle here and then I'd be able to just go to his area here. Ship appears here and then I walk in and say, Hey, I'm gonna look up a guide <laughs> to find out which art is right. I always look up a guide. I do not know art, okay? I do not know art, so I look up a guide every single time he shows up. Because, you know, I, I just can't... A bell cricket? I have you already. Dang it. But do I have you in the thing? Probably. Yes, I do. Okay. That hurt having a bright light on screen because, like, it's been dark the whole time. Yeah, that hurts. That hurts my eyes. You're welcome for the eye strain. Okay. Please don't give me a beehive. Okay. I need acorns to craft the fall furniture. And unfortunately, I think acorns only have like a 7% chance of spawning, I think. Or maybe it's a 4% chance, I don't know. It's a very low percent chance, but there's a 50% chance of getting nothing from a tree. So, I I, I just I, I just can't. I, I, I can't do that. I, I... Acorns are so hard to get. I think that's the same statistics with the pine cones as well same kind of percentages and everything yeah sucks and pine cones I can't get until I go all the way up here and all of my trees are surrounded by flowers so I really need to get rid of my flowers soon please give me something literally anything just pine cones pine cones and nothing else they need to increase the drop rate of these things there's one but I need I need a pine cone! Give me a pine cone! Come on! I don't want sticks! I want a pine cone! Come on! I'm never gonna get a pine cone, am I? I got one. One pine cone! You can't do better than that! How dare you! Okay, fine. Fine! Fine! I'll take my one pine cone and leave you! Now you have to give me- Yay, a pine cone! <laughs> oh, yay, more pine cone! Oh, great, a stick. Well, this tree is more friendly than you, other tree. Hey, a third pine cone! Hey, I'm getting pretty good with the pine cones here. Acorns hate me, but, you know, you, you know, pine cones, they're not that bad. Pine cones... I'm gonna let you be friendly. I'm gonna let you be friends with me, pine cones. You can be friends with me, pine cones. I will be friends with pine cones if they will be friends with me. I have four pine cones. Isn't that fun? Isn't that just great? I'm gonna check if I have pine cones in my storage because I probably don't. I don't want to pay for you yet. I really don't want to pay for you yet. I would like to pay for you all in one go so I actually can make a bunch of money. Okay, here we go. Let's go to my home so I can see if I have storage. Also, I would love to be able to just... Actually, I'll go over this as soon as I enter the home. Or, no, I'll just talk about it now. Who cares? You're probably not even here for the gameplay. I would love if they added, uh, the ability to just access your storage from a crafting bench in your home. Like, if your workbench is in your home, you'd be able to access your storage from the workbench, so you won't have to grab everything out of storage. That'd be great! That'd be really cool! That would make things so much faster. ALSO! I would love to craft things in bulk. You don't know how many times I've wanted to craft fish bait, and then it just takes forever because you're crafting fish bait after fish bait after fish bait. Why the hell do I have all these things in here? Um... I'm so confused. Why do I have just olive flounders and bluegills and oysters and things? Why, why do I have the- I have a pale chub. Why? That thing costs nothing. I have a glow stick, the light stick. Fine. Glow stick, though. That's what it's called. Acorns. Okay, I do have some of those. I have a bunch of mushrooms that I can use for other things. Uh, I have three pine cones, so 
Okay, I'm gonna see if I can craft literally anything. Come on. Let's craft! And I'm gonna sort... But... By order obtained, order obtained. And I'm gonna scroll all the way to the top, and I can craft this. Pile of leaves, here we go. Who knows, I might make a fall room, or, you know, just make a little fall area. So keep crafting. Do I have any other fall items? I have a garden wagon, I have a wild log bench, I have a leaf campfire. Which is just great. Love that, just love it. Made a leaf campfire, keep crafting. Why do you keep freaking sorting? Fine. Fine. I only have a few of these. Like, I don't even have... It's just this... Is this just a leaf furniture set? Okay. I made a yellow leaf pile. Yay, I'm making leaves all over the place. Uh, I need maple leaves, and I don't even think you can get those yet. That's great. Okay, I don't even know why you get yellow leaves from acorns. That doesn't make any sense. Um... I would love to find, um, more fall items, and I can't find any of them. I'll look good outside. Seasonal recipe. This is probably where I should have started. Okay. Pine bonsai tree. That would look terrible outside, I'm gonna tell you that now. Spooky wand. I need star fragments for that, and I hate star fragments. Okay. Considering the fact I'm getting kind of bored, um, I'm gonna just stop playing now, so, um, can't wait for the Nintendo Direct in, um, uh, too long didn't watch. I'm just gonna say, hey, I want Tortimer's Island, I want Zelda items, Metroid items, I want, uh, I just really want to see the roost, uh, the roost, not the roost, okay. I just want to see the roost in detail, I want... More than just the roost. There is no way they can spend 20 minutes in the roost. Although they're probably going to spend like at least 5 minutes on amiibo cards, which is going to suck. Like, hey, we could add so much new content, but you know what? We're just going to talk about amiibo cards for characters you already know. Yeah, I don't know. But maybe it would be cool. Maybe. Useless amiibo cards, because you can probably just get the wolf link by scanning the link amiibo. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, so I am gonna leave now. Bye!